That's coming up on June 16th in Dickinson. So to tell me more about this fun event is Jackie Jenkin, co-founder of Bakken Barbecue, as well as Crystal Kester, committee member. Good morning to you, ladies. Good, Good morning. morning. Good morning. Uh, even from Dickinson time, too, mountain time. Okay, but I think we're already hungry for barbecue, so what's the big Bakken Barbecue about? So our event was created to give back to our community uh, we created this event in 2013 and our event has grown substantially. We have went from about five to six cookers now up to 40 plus cookers and even a waiting list. And our event went from 500 attendees to well over uh, 5,000 people attending our event. So it's been pretty exciting to watch it grow in our community, um, in the Dickinson community, Southwest North Dakota, and even the Bakken. Okay, so I did hear that right. You have a wait list for barbecue. How many are on this list right now? We have about four or five companies on the wait list. Okay, but then how many are cooking right now on that list then? 39. 39 different types of meat, pretty much, or barbecue, I should say. <laughs> yeah. Okay, so you're going to get your money's worth if these are tickets that you have to pay for. Is that the case? You need tickets in advance? Yes. Okay, so you got to come in and stop by to try all 39, 40 different kinds of barbecues. And so who are these people that are cooking? So many of the people that are cooking are local companies in the area. We kind of really focused on oil and gas. And over the last couple of years, our um, cooking booths have really expanded. And it also includes insurance companies, local companies, clubs, um, just a variety of people that are out here wanting to cook and show off their cooking skills. So it's pretty exciting as we've expanded to see these other groups wanting to be involved. We even have individuals that reach out to us that want to cook. So um, it's exciting to see how excited everyone in our community gets with about our event. Absolutely. All right. Now that we're hungry, is it just me or does it include like sides and things too? There's sides and things as well. Okay. And then so. this year we actually added on um, like the kitty corner. And so we have booths that'll be designated to like foods and snacks for the kids as well. Okay, so nobody's walking out hungry, of course. No, <laughs> definitely not. And so, good. I heard you say a little bit ago that you wanted to give back to the community. Is this uh, something, or like, what is the benefit to the community here? The, the funds go somewhere, or, or who's, who's the benefit? So the first three years that we did, um, had started the Bakken Barbecue, we were kind of exclusive to Relay for Life. And um, we decided that we wanted to get involved in our community and we teamed up with Make-A-Wish North Dakota, who has been fantastic and we've loved working with them. We've loved getting involved with the Make-A-Wish kids. And over the last uh, handful of years, we've also expanded to helping other local nonprofits, um, such as our Women Empowering Women, uh, food drive programs, holiday gift giving, um, so there's been a lot of people, families in need in our community. They've reached out to us. Um, it's just kind of something we take as a committee and consider and vote upon um, that if we want to give back to that that event. Absolutely. I mean, it's such a good benefit, especially when you have 5,000 people attending. I mean, that's definitely going to give back to uh, the region, of course. And, you know, it's all about barbecue. But do you have entertainment and everything, too? Yes. We have... Um, a different DJ every year. Um, we have like dancing at the front. It's a lot of like networking. Um, for the kitty area, we have inflatables and games, face painting. We have all sorts of goodies that go on. So sounds like an event that you just can't miss, of course, in Dickinson. And you don't even have to live in Dickinson to go. You can travel from Bismarck, Watford City, everywhere Absolutely. is welcome. So how do you want people to go get tickets? Can you get them at the door or do you prefer them online? We offer both. Okay. Um, I think we, so we, you can buy, you can pre-purchase tickets online or send us an email at bakkenbbq.com. Uh, tickets can be purchased the day of. $20 for tickets uh, for 13 and up, $10 for children 6 to 12, and 5 and under are free. Okay, easy enough. And it's at the uh, West River Ice Rink, so make sure you go there in Dickinson. Yes. All right, uh, one more question. Is there an overall winner? Is this being judged, all the good barbecue? So this is definitely being judged. Okay. We have four categories. Um, we have a chicken, beef, pork, and other. 
and we kind of divide it up and we do a blind judging. So the food is brought to uh, a group. The group takes it into the judges judges inside the rec center. And, um, you know, there's uh, seven to 10 judges per category and they could tally those votes and overall winner gets the first place gets a trophy. And then we also offer a people's choice, but the people's choice is the Holy Grail trophy at our <laughs> event. Everybody goes crazy over it. They oh, want to yeah. win people's choice. So as as you showed one of those photos, uh, that was Denny's Electric. They were our winner of people's choice last year. Oh, that sounds amazing. Okay, I'm going to leave you with this question now. Out of, uh, I'm going to ask both of you, what are you looking forward to most? So what type of barbecue? The brisket, the, maybe a chicken? I don't know. What's your favorite? Mine has always been ribs, but mm -hmm. this year we have a few people that are trying like different exotic kind of meats. Okay. And I think that's going to be quite the hit this year. Oh, you talked me into it. Ladies, we want to thank <laughs> you for coming down here for the 11th annual Bakken Barbecue. Thank you.